estamos com a Ana Rondar, é ela que venceu a segunda ronda deste Porto da Luz 35, Ana, congratulations, uh, I'm sure you wanted that this third set was coming to your side, you, you, you saw, you saw, I saw you very confident, uh, even after the second set, but was it important to lose the first set, so it was a, a wake-up call to you? Uh, I wish I would have won the I first know, set, of course. so it's tough to say now, I mean, yeah, but, um, it was a very close first set, it could have gone my way, I had my chances, which I couldn't take, but yeah, uh, I was just uh, telling myself to, to keep fighting, keep uh, being there and I will have my chances in the second set and I think I could elevate my level a bit, so I think I was dominating in the second set and while it was an unfortunate finish, so I wish you all the best, but uh, I'm happy with the level from my second set. Were you surprised by uh, Kinja Klaus in the first set? Uh, I knew her, mm -hmm. I know her game style, I know where she were gonna go for a uh, big shot, so I was expecting a, a tough match and uh, that's actually how it went, but I'm really happy I could uh, manage in, uh, from the second set on. Was it important the first serve percentage just because you have a very good serve, it's one of your best shots. Uh, was it important to, to, to be very accurate with the serve? So you can win more points and be in front of the match? Yes, definitely. It always helps when I can keep my serve percentage high. And I think it was a lot higher in the second set than in the first. And it always gives me confidence in the return games also, so I can play more freely. Uh, then I, uh, I can uh, hold my serve, so it definitely helped. You were top 50 in 2022. Uh, you won WTA, you played in the higher level and you're playing in this tournament. Uh, what's your goal for this season? Well, I want to be back to top 100 as soon as possible. Uh, I came to this tournament to play uh, as many matches as possible to gain my confidence back a little bit. So we're building back from here and uh, yeah, we're just going step by step. Uh, step, by step. Uh, yeah, and first of all, the first goal is just to be back to top 100 and to be enjoying the Grand Slams. And what about Porto? What do you expect in this tournament? It's very nice actually. Uh, I like uh, the courts. I like, um, like uh, we have everything uh, here close by. We have the gym here. Uh, we have a uh, possibility to eat restaurants. So the hotel is also close by. The weather was super nice until now. <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, today it was raining, but uh, so far I really like it.